Hey guys, so today is the 24th of January and I grabbed me a snack, you saw me cutting 
I've just uh, finished cutting the um, fashion fabrics, the ones that are going to be on top, the ones that you're going to see. <sighs> I am tired. I am super tired and I think I'm going to call it a day. So thank you guys so much for watching. I don't know if this part will be included in the vlog that I was shooting or not. I don't know. But please like, share, comment, subscribe and turn on your post notification bell so that you'll be alerted whenever I post and that's on. Period. Comment down, down below, please. Please. <laughs> Okay guys, so I've just stitched the lining and I've just placed it over the main uh, dress and over here is everything that I, I cut um, which unfortunately I lost all the footage I, I had done for this bit everything that I did for cutting here I lost the footage the only thing that's left to be stitched on the main um, dress outside and the lining is the goddet at the back and then I'll only stitch the laces the lace part of the dress after I'm done stitching the skeleton which is all these parts that are here so I fused my skeleton twice with paper violin and fabric violin. I, when I say all of the footage I had is gone because the phone I was using crashed. I had like four videos in there. But that's besides the point. We moved from where we were. So this is our skeleton and we are going to stitch on boning on these pieces here they are steady enough see what's happening because now I use that other iron the iron that I used before my professional iron it's broken so I have to use the that iron here <laughs> you, you know it the tiny one and over here is the petticoat part, which is going to go at the bottom of our skeleton. So all of this is um, for the petticoat. And I cut 25 centimeter long, I mean wide, yes, 25 centimeter wide um, strips of uh, mesh. And I folded the thing salvage to salvage. 
I had done a little trick on here. I even showed you how to do it. So I, I had done a little trick here with a pencil. So I marked from the top of my table over there, 25 centimeters. And then I folded my mesh. Um, I folded it uh, salvage to salvage so that when I, I placed it like that, I could just cut from that end to the other end without having to keep on measuring with um, my chalk and measuring tape. So that's what I did over here. I'm sure you can feel I don't even want to talk. <laughs> I don't even want to talk because I am so sad actually that all of my footage is lost. After all of the amount of work that I did, I'm really disappointed. So right now, I don't know which I'm going to start with. Either the boning for our skeleton here or just go ahead and stitch the petticoat. I'm going to have two of them. So I'm going to have um, what three tiered uh, petticoats. But there's going to be two of them. So I need them to be two. One on top of each other. One of, on top of the other. <laughs> Even the English has left me. Oh my god. Okay. Let me get on with it.
okay so i'm done with the bones that i have in the studio my client is gonna bring me some more and this is how they are looking i did three on center front and then two on the side front panel i'm going to do two here on the side back and one there and then i need some right here in the bust dart all right i'll catch you up when i'm stitching the petticoat <laughs> wanted to um outro the video we are dropping the sunday i didn't do a whole lot of uh talking in the video because after losing all of that footage i was so heartbroken i really did not want to talk so yeah this is us my sister and i bidding you <laughs> farewell till next time please like share comment subscribe and turn on your post notification bell so that you'll be alerted to whenever post and that's on who period leave a comment down below like the video bye